So for this video, I am going to be in Val interviewing Bamukoto on a certain question. I wanted to just ask him this one question. I want to say, I'm going to talk to you about the camera. See that video right now, and I do want to highlight his channel will be down in the description. So if you scroll down the description below, you will see his channel. You can go over there, subscribe, and watch uh, the videos that he has published over there. Now, do want to mention that I'm gonna explain a little bit of what he's saying because he doesn't speak in English. He speaks in a language that is comfortable in. So do check him out. It'll be down in the description below. And you will see the video, the full video back over there. I wanted to highlight a few things or the question that I wanted to ask him about his experience when he went to these places where some of these false pastors and all these people go out there and get powers. He went there and he was introduced to it by people that were there. He didn't even know it. Sometimes people think these things are only done by black people. No, it was a white person that told him about it and said, no, do you know that this, this water does this, this, this. And so wanted to bring this particular conversation up right now and to give a warning for people that are just out there thinking everything is all Gucci, everything is all Pasha Asha. No, some people are really out there going into these places to so that when they come back, they can manipulate and use these powers to their benefit. It's a check reality check. And in this particular video, that's what we're going to talk about. This video is sponsored by RA. So do check them out. They do key duplication and true uh, and uh, programming for your key. So if you want a spare key, do holler at them. The number will be down there. Back in a second to interpret for people that might not understand when he is speaking. Because today, Ricky is balled up. I'm in the field. We are at work, you know, Agna break, Agna. <laughs> and today we do have Amukoto. I have Amukoto here today. I'm at their studio down in the Val. That's Angel Noko. It's her music that's playing in the background. It's probably going to claim my video, but it's okay. So, um, there is something that I wanted to have a conversation with you guys about. It's going to be very short. The main video, there's going to be main videos I'm going to do. Uh, with Bob Mkoto, so those ones will be coming on later on soon. So do look out for that one. Now, Bob Mkoto, I wanted to ask certain questions. I haven't interviewed Bob Mkoto on this, on, on this channel. So this is the first time. I've known this man for over 10 years. There was a main video that once came out about Mount of Source. And you, ha you narrated an entire story. There's one particular element out of that story that you told that I wanted you to go back onto. When you entered the water, <laughs> what water is this? You said you entered and you came out what again? You can just give that small little brief. We'll come back to that later. No, I said it's a it's a halamau. If you tell us about it, say no, it's a little bit late or na. Wait, eh <laughs> You were there, you were accompanying him or? No, I was there. Oh, okay. I was there, 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 I was Get tell us, get tell a class. I get tell a class. 
Mm. Eke sa yi si di ben sena san jwe tanka sona kita husena seka ni di dova ni me tia sona anasui ki lebe. Ki anka ke yi posa. Mtwe na yi fitla hape hore rola di eta u kenye mauto kamona. Kya ke rola di eta ke kenye mauto mpa ya hono chesa hono sna lele baka lele kalo. Mm. Tabona le mina hano ye. Mm. Kenya nga haka mauto kamono kya kukwa mauto wana ika huna lintu e nyulu wanka hari e batang. Mm. Jalo kamo ya fela wa 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 ekon. Mm. Ifi tile iye mamo na hakukwa iye mamo na mangwele nita sa mangwele momo miti ya na fela ting. Mm. Ka ukwa mauto wana ka sekisa wa ukwi. Kutwa haka kamo. Mm. This and more to come later on. They say there is a river that contains waters, portals into dead sparrow. Some of your pastors. So it was a very short uh, discussion. I just wanted him to introduce the subject. And then when I go back, we can then uh, go into all the other areas about that subject that he then talks about. Uh, the thing to note here is that uh, these places where he was, or this place where he was, you will note, he didn't even know it. It was the white man that knew, if you enter that water, that water will have some powers and whatnot. And the thing about it, or the hint that you would hear at the end, is me saying, there are pastors that go to these places and got these waters and got these powers from these places, and they use these powers when they come into church. So this is why in this conversation, I just wanted to hint at it. Um, I wanted to hint at it because people don't understand that they think, oh no, it's just uh, black voodoo, what, 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 what. But you can see here, there are white people that knew about it. As a matter of fact, a white person knew more uh, than the other guys who were there. So once he got there, uh, basically what he's explaining is that there were different uh, streams there were different streams there was different portals of the water one was a bit filthy one was like this and he wasn't even looking at this particular one that was pointed out for him and so later on he was told no get him and he told the guy to hold the camera and film him while he does this and he enters so you see him entering the water and you see him while he's in the water he says what he felt was a bit different to what uh, you might experience in the thing. He says the water, um, as he entered, it is put his feet in the water, his feet started to get cold, and it was as if there was cold air that uh, started rising uh, from the bottom of, of his feet all the way up to where the, the water was at. And this is when he decided, hey, something is up here, man, they must go out. And so he says that this water was kind of almost crippling because he wasn't there to get any powers. But this is the thing now, is that there are people that are now going to these streams to collect powers, to get powers from these um, territorial spirits, spirits that are very territorial within certain location. And this video was just a highlight of that, to say there are these places, they exist, they are out there. Uh, we advise people not to do these things, not to go into these places because you'll find yourself in hot waters. Okay, you'll find yourself in hot waters and you'll introduce yourself into dark magic. That's why all these people that go up there, they enter into churches where you are being told holy water this, holy this, holy this, holy ash, holy what not. All these things that you don't see the apostles in the Bible making a reference about. You must know that you are entering yourself into other things. And so in the interview, when I start talking to him, we will then get into all these other things. Uh, kind of just little highlights here and there. But the one thing that I wanted to note in this video is that there are pastors who intentionally have gone to these places and they have went to, to use these powers in order to benefit themselves, to brainwash followers, to, to use this juju over the people. And so that's the one thing that we wanted to, uh, to, uh, to tackle in this video. I wanted to highlight it. Uh, it's a really great studio that he has built out. You know, uh, the man is dedicated to the work. He's dedicated to the work and uh, amazing stuff. So it is the Change Radio. That, that particular uh, thing, uh, the link will be down in the description below. You can go and check uh, this channel. 
where he publishes these things. They don't do translation. Translation takes too too long. I did a video when was it last week or last of last week. I'm still not done with it. Okay, translation takes too long to actually wrap up. And so, if you do hear the language, you can go over there and subscribe. And I'm sure you'll enjoy the videos that are over there.